September 8th, Vote House, Shea Strazella. So, bedroom number four. Here we have the lintels up. The That's the top beam over the windows. One more or two more rows of block and then the roof line starts. So, so this is where we need to know. So we've, we've put some columns in already here. One, two, three. This is on the master side. So then uh, that's why we need to catch the height of that new balcony coming in. And, and then the overhang that we're going to give you for the final depth. But you have seven and a half feet of usable, seven feet of usable space from, from this edge to the thing. So it, it's, it's pretty good. I mean, here, this is a 50 gallon drum pan, which measures approximately 20, let me see, 20, two inches in diameter. Now obviously the table would be bigger, it'd be about maybe three feet at least in diameter. And then your chairs around it. You know. It's you'd have space, but as you're saying, it's not any huge space, but enough to move around. Get up and move around. Um so but if the if if the, you came out of your kitchen, let's let's do a walk through here. There we are in the kitchen. Kitchen. We're walking out of your kitchen. Boom, we're onto your area. So maybe, maybe this is where your table would have to be. Maybe we could do a a retractable mesh here. A retractable mesh here. And then maybe have it end here. But then the table would be right here. So you'd come out, table would be here. If you needed to get around, I guess you could come around this way. And this is where the other section would be. Yeah, maybe it could work. Or this would be where the pool would be. Now this 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 post is not going to be here anymore. That's going to be gone. That post is going to be gone because this is the pool deck. So you're you're going to walk right out here, have a few more feet before you get to the pool. Now we have that column there that's going to be there. Can't get rid of that. So we need that there. And I figure pool deck might even come all the way up to here the pool deck so the railing would start here and go out like this and that would be railed off this would all be open open post is there but all this is open all this is open and there is your pool right there so you just jump into your pool bedrooms getting ready to cast that one oh I did something to the bathroom here just took the liberty of changing this without consulting you but originally we're having a shower here and because you don't want a shower we're doing the shower spas so the tub was going to be here this is where the shower spa will be and what I did was I eliminated the shower that was going to be here we're putting the toilet now here because i think the toilet actually fits in that spot really nicely it is like it's made for the toilet and then the original vanities were here and i moved them to this wall i'm going to move and that's where the toilet was as you can see the pipe but um i decided to put a bigger vanity here for you I'm gonna make it um, a double basin vanity because this bathroom now is gonna serve three rooms so I figured you need as much counter space in here and then um, so I just thought it would work out better than sticking it over because this wall is shorter here for, for a vanity with a double basin whereas this one is very long and so that's where it's gonna be now double vanity I made an executive decision and this is your linen closet that's 
is your bedroom. So there's your windows. These now went to five feet. This is your, I'm back at the front now. This is the front. Right. Here's your openings. This is the, these are gonna be the main stairs to get into the house. This is the living, dining, kitchen. So now you're getting a better feel. Everything's blocking up now. It's coming on really nice. Last, you know, this is uh, bedroom two. Bedroom two. The door to the bathroom is gone. Closet. Five foot window. Columns going up. There's your columns. That's it. Let's do a little walkthrough. So, bedroom two, utility closet. To be your well actually this is your laundry room this is your official laundry room this is your laundry room this is your panels uh, master bedroom this will be the kitchen 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 so um, sink stove fridge you're going to have an island right here. Now that that little concrete pantry thing that was here is gone. It opens this wider. A nice big open concept kitchen. Back into bedroom number four. And your pool. Okay. All right, let's go downstairs. So, it's the original garage. gonna be just a new garage. Well, I don't know. Maybe. Yep. Lots of space. Because then this is a, the stairs comes through here. Where this board is, is the stairs, and it does a little bend and go back down. So it's a double level stairs. And then this is the area underneath. Lots of space under here. I don't know what you're going to do under here? All of the space. Space, space, space. be the pool area. Here we are upstairs. So that's you have approximately from the edge of the deck to the fence line, I think twenty twenty two feet, twenty three feet. So this is where I was saying, technically, we could come into 10 feet. 
and extend all of this at least another 10 feet out and go this way. Damage my tree. 